So as you can see, this ship is pretty damn big, and we are pretty damn small. And there's a seagull. What a dunce. What a good word. Dunce. I like that. So again, we, get, we see these really fat people. Some of them are wearing masks, and they're all boarding this ship called the Maul, M-A-W. This is the last level of the, of the main vanilla game. If you watch the screen, everything's shaking. You'll see why in a second. Must attack world maw. There why it's shaking. It's shaking because they're so fat, they're so large, that every time they can they take a step in unison, it shakes the entire ship. Look at him. Ugh. I especially think the old guy is creepy. And then if you look up here on the left, there's the woman who we've been smashing statues of the entire game. She's the owner of this joint. And she's skinny, that's true. She's just making all the money off of them. Ugh, look at this guy. He's such a glutton. So, long story short, they're basically, I think, eating all these kids they're growing in the bottom of the ship. That's where all this meat is coming from. Because we see the janitor bagging it, making it into the, putting it on the meat hooks. We see the cooks chopping it up into different uh, dishes, and then we see these guys eating it. And it looks like they're coming on the ship potentially to feed off of all the meat, which is pretty freaking disgusting. So yeah, these guys can't, they're so fat, when they start chasing, they can't actually chase us, they have to crawl. Coming up here is one of my favorite moments in the entire game. Look at her hand. Look at it. Good tasting children. Look at her hand. Watch, watch her hand as I jump over. Watch this. She is doing some serious hand acrobatics. And her wobbly chin, I know. I know! All right, it's so gross, it's so gross. And I'm actually gonna show you guys, I'm gonna let them catch me up here. Oh, okay, I also forgot, we can hug this guy. To even further reinforce that they really are eating the children, if they catch us, they eat us! Like crazy people. Right? Yeah. Delicious. Delicious pigs. I mean kids. So we're probably gonna get caught doing this anyway, because we have to run across here without them catching us. But if if, if if we don't get caught... Oh, we got caught. Okay, cool. Watch! They eat us! <laughs> it's actually so disgusting. They just shove... They just shove us in their mouth. Whole. We're that, we're that tiny. There's also, if you look closely, there's a nice little picture of us in, in the corner right there. 
kind of up at an angle like that. Just pinned to the pinned to the box over there. I don't really know how that got there, but. No! Oh god. His last guy gets us all the time. So I'm gonna double check real quick, but I think once we've hugged the guy, we've we've permanently hugged him for that playthrough. Yeah, so he he's gone. Can we run across this table without getting grabbed and eaten? Yeah. We fell off. We didn't die. We actually made it and then fell off. Delightful. Yeah, okay, now we got it. There we go. Easy. First try, chat. First try. I think there might be a candle over here to light, maybe? No, looks like there's not, okay. Let's keep going. There's so many of them and they all just look exactly the same. Just giant and fat and disgusting. And eating, like, literally raw meat. It is made from children. Nice, okay. A what?! The falling bottle knocked us off. That's some cruel stuff right there. <laughs> 14? Yeah, I think so. Alright, cool. So here's the deal with this one. This guy is gonna fall off the thing and start chasing us. He has giant cheeks, by the way. Kind of looks like a hammerhead shark. And he's gonna get stuck here. So we have to jump on top of him and run. Ah! Nice, we got it. Okay, cool. I think we can just squeeze straight through these. Yeah, okay, and there's a Matryoshka doll right here, which we're gonna have to get later. There's one of the cooks. I think he's gonna come in here, and then he'll shut the door behind him, and then we can solve the puzzle of this room. He can but disconnected. Too many deaths. There have been infinite number of deaths. So. So this, this one actually took me a while to figure out, this puzzle here. Um, but it actually turns out that this mirror 
is a fake mirror, like at in police stations and stuff. And someone has literally put a chair behind it and is watching people use the restroom. Which is disgusting. <laughs> Look at this. <laughs> it was a two-way mirror. Blech. Blech. Okay. Let's keep going. Wait, no! We have to do this whole area again? Shit, okay. We, we looked over at chat and just fell off the pipe and died. Which was pretty unlucky. You can do YouTube, but um, Nightbot will fight Ekenbot, and Ekenbot will get timed out. Oh yeah, let's see if we can get another random fact up here. I'm, I'm always down for a random fact. All right. So if we, instead of dropping off here, actually follow this pipe. All the way along, we can drop down on this table and get the Metrioshka doll. Yeah, nice. The 15th US president continuously bought slaves with his own money in order to free them. That's super cool, I had no idea. All right, we did it. But I believe we found all the Metrioshka dolls in the game. Take this elevator down. Just light this lantern for a hundred percent lantern run. Oh, yeah, that's right. But these guys are going to bust out of this freaking wall. And in a massive horde, chase me on the ground. Ugh. Look at them. They're like animals. I'm not sure if we're gonna make it. I don't know if we're gonna make it. Oh yeah, we did. Hell yeah. One more random fact. Do yes for one more. Steam, the commands won't work if you have two exclamation marks. You can only you can only have one. Okay, so we're getting hungry again. Which again is a pretty established fact. Men are six times more likely to be struck by lightning than women. Weird. Ekenbot is just gonna keep shelling out the random facts. <laughs> Oh, a little dude we can hug while we're hungry, right? He's gonna give a he's gonna give us a sausage to eat. Hell yeah, I'll take a sausage. We 
We just ate the little dude. We just ate him. <laughs> it's unavoidable. We can't... We can't not eat him. It's really freaking awful. We've been saving them all game. And slowly our hunger's been building up. And we finally... Had to eat them. Always the worst, I agree. I agree. He's like handing us the sausage. He's like, oh, here, we love you. Help, here, here's help, here's food. And then instead of taking the sausage, you just eat him. So there's the lady. The one we've been kind of, sort of following this entire game. She appears to be like the owner of this restaurant, the mall, whatever it is. One in every five? How do they get that statistic? I don't believe that. Although that would be pretty dang cool. Although, and I guess they could just survey a bunch of people. That seems like inaccurate data. So we, it seems like we're up in this lady's uh, inhabiting part of the ship, wherever she inhabits. And if you listen closely, you can hear her singing. Also, if you look at these paintings on the wall, all of the paintings that are of women, that are of her, at younger or older, have their faces covered up by something. See? And this picture on the wall is actually the picture of the of a ship of the ship that we're on from the outside. So I don't think I don't think it's possible to avoid her the first time we go through. I think she always catches you. Again, we're up here searching for a key to get through the through the door. And here, if you look at this painting as well, this picture's covered up. And if you look at the mirror she's breaking she's brushing her hair in front of, it's broken. So that you start to kind of think like maybe she can't see her reflection, maybe she doesn't like her reflection. Coming stops. And we have the key. Let's get this last doll. I think that's all of them. Now the music is softly being played on instruments in the background. Same music she was humming. Again, all of the mirrors in this area are broken. Shit, I forgot. We must run, chat. <laughs> Oof, okay. Keep going, you fool. She's kind of magically powerish, if you haven't noticed.
All right, so there's only one way to defeat her, and I'm guessing you can probably guess how it is, what it is. It's to make her look at her reflection. I'm gonna go in here. Any more random facts? Eganbot's tired out. Run, chat, run! <laughs> and so we're gonna pick this mirror up. It's the only unbroken mirror in the entire place. And we're gonna force her to stare at herself until she dies. The best boss fight in the world. Let's do this. Wow, that was really fast. We died. See? Southern sea otters have flaps of skin under their forelegs that are, act as pockets. When diving, they use these pouches to store rocks and food. That's super cool. Some of these facts are really cool. Hmm. We just died really fast there. So we need to be a little more careful. scare her away that was just strange guess we need to be a little more careful third try is the charm I guess have you <laughs> tell us a joke Steen hit us up with one Nice, we got it. Fourteen times, that's not too bad. Let's go, fifteen times. Oh, shit. Fifteen times, that's still not awful, I guess. <laughs> the joke in a second all focus right now oh wait no And 13 of the deaths have been in 30 minutes. I agree. It's true. What's the difference between a jeweler and a jailer? One watches, one sells watches, and one watches sells. True. That's a pretty good one. I like that. Very punny. I think we have to do this four, maybe five times, I believe. 